We welcome you back to iLiveToday.com at the Boulevard Cafe on the Boulevard. And this is no bull sitting or standing. We are going to have a tremendous third annual Streets of Lancaster Grand Prix from October 6th through the 9th. And if you look down the boulevard here, of course, these vehicles not moving nearly as quickly as a couple of go-karts did this morning who came out and tested the course. Tom Kutcher from Supercarts USA and Mike from Willow Springs Karting Club were out to check the new course. Now that the boulevard has been complete touching 100 miles an hour as they came down the boulevard this morning. It's going to be unbelievable. Scusa, it's kind of the, the transition from uh, Tri-C Carters to Scusa as a sanctioning body. It's kind of like the transition from the Antelope Valley Ravens to the California League with the Lancaster Jethawks. It is that big a step up. And Tom Kutcher, the gentleman we spoke to this morning, says he envisions this race being the biggest street race in the world within five years. Now, he's going to bring several Indy 500 champions to the event on that weekend, which is the week before the IndyCar Championship at Las Vegas. It's going to be a tremendous weekend. And uh, with, with long straightaways involved this year, remember last year because of the uh, construction that was had not yet been completed here on the boulevard, there was only uh, parts of the boulevard that could be used. This year, they have huge passing areas, and he says it's as smooth as glass to ride on. They were very excited this morning, and it's going to be some party. Vroom with a view right here on the boulevard for the third annual Streets of Lancaster Grand Prix and stick with iLiveToday.com because you know Jim Greenleaf is going to give you everything that's going on including sitting on top of the man's cart as he's going 100 miles an hour because watch for that video on Time Warner right here on this very website. So I'm Brian Golden from Jim TV. For when news breaks, we fix it. And boy, they're going to be breaking some things around here in the third annual Streets of Lancaster Grand Prix.